This room will be white. Because you're lazy to color, right? No. You sure? Sure. Look at me and say you're sure. sure. Look at me. Sure. Look at the camera. Sure. Alright guys, so today we're going to be filming Team NOC! I'm waiting for the challenge to be issued to me today. Maybe it's something like completing 10,000 steps by walking around your own house. Or maybe another kitchen challenge. So we'll see. I just woke up. As you can tell, I'm still in my pyjamas. I am going to do a challenge today. But I don't know what the challenge is. So I'm just going to like... Um, prepare myself as best as I can for it. We are waiting for the producers to let us know what the challenge is for today. Are you excited, Ellie? Yeah? Not as excited as I am. I have a new challenge. Raj just released the challenge. He said to draw the most memorable time in NOC, be it whether is it a shoot or is it outside shoot. I've sat here for really the past one hour, you know, trying to think of a most memorable moment because I have so many despite being an NOC for this long Memorable is like here right but traumatic is like here so what was traumatic for me a traumatic moment in time for me was in episode 5 where I had to literally like personally eliminate my own teammate in the episode which is Nicholas lah yeah, and like send him home the first day that I worked with NOC was for the Wata video and I was on makeup. That was the first time I went to Ryan and Sylvia's house. Yeah, the first outfit that I saw her in was actually in her underwear or sleeping clothes with a lot of holes. Uh, first time on camera was zombie video. That one was was kind of fun. I will choose my favourite memory um, in during the Real Housewives of Yishun shoot. I used to like drawing, I guess. So I do have a part of my room that is filled with like a uh, craft arts material. I got pencil eraser. And then I have this one that I won at some drawing competition. It was quite a noob competition, that's why I won. Let me show you how like Atas is as a world color pencil. So it comes in this wooden box with a velvety base. And this gold essence here for you to open. This are my Atas with four color pencils. So one of the most memorable moments would be getting kicked out of, or more like knocked out of knockout. Yeah, that's probably it. Most memorable doesn't mean it has to be a good experience or pleasant experience, right? When I look back on it, right, I just want to laugh. So let's start. I think I'm going to plan to draw the Halloween party at NOC because it was very fun and very memorable. Who's going to be inside? Mm. Agent Coco. Anyone else? Mm. If I know how to draw Silver Jijie. Have fun. Thank you. I took a very long time trying to get into media or trying to get into entertainment and nothing worked out. So when I stepped into office for the first time, that meant something to me. Yeah, it was very significant to me. So if I were to erase all of my memory and just choose one, I will remember that forever. I hope mine is good enough, law. <laughs> What's going to happen here is this. I'm going to be drawing something that is very memorable to me because I almost lost my So I've been here for like... 8 months. A uh, Hiroshima trip was quite memorable. Which part of Hiroshima? Onsen. That was like my first week getting to know like uh, Joanna, Nina, Suvia all. And we had to like bathe together naked. I don't think we can draw that out. So we just let's just leave it there. Okay, knockout was good. Knockout was stressful but it was memorable because it was stressful. Yeah. So there was this day that we stayed until like 12 or 1am and our brains were fried I swear but we had to go on so we just cooked supper for ourselves so I'm gonna start drawing that this is my picture reference so the hardest part about drawing your friends faces is that you really want to get it right but the only uh, saving grace is that they are in character so it shouldn't really look like their true selves yeah so I'm going to draw out this particular moment in my masterpiece of sorts. 
Family, so how is your drawing coming along? Uh, good. This is my mom. Mm -hmm. This is me. This is Bella Tietie. And this one is Silver Tietie. Then what is this? The entrance of the Halloween maze. Then why your picture of girl? One? Because the boys are late. Alright, I've just drawn Sylvia. How fast or not? Now I'm going to try to draw Dikosh pointing and laughing at me hysterically like a chupache, you know, like <laughs> you're out. Okay, I just drew Dikosh. Can y'all see? Ta-da! And now I'm going to draw Ryan, Nina, and Akers like the three emoji monkeys. The one that the one one like see no evil, speak no evil, and hear no evil. Right now, I'm drawing the the bottom of our kitchen table. I mean, it's been so long since we went to the office because of circuit breaker. I kind of miss the office. I'm normally not so affectionate. I don't really show like um love. Okay, anyway, I just thought of the most genius idea, which is to get their photo on your phone. Can you see? This is our. Go full screen brightness and lock and we are going to trace him out. Ladies and gentlemen, this is our look like him right? So this is Charmaine, she's gonna be here cooking Maggie. I'm gonna slot myself here. There are times where I'm here. Lah. I'll be here and I'll be holding a bowl waiting for food. Meanwhile, <laughs> I'm trying to get Aurelia's face right Who remembers the hair that's coming down from the side of her face Well, thanks to this challenge, I got all my Copic markers out If not, they're just rotting in my drawer I remember this dumpster scene when we were actually shooting I think it took about 4 takes We all had to stand in the dumpster while Virus had the clicker to open the shutters so we couldn't show on our faces, right, any form of uh, reaction to the smell. And it was really fun. I wouldn't do it again, but it's quite an experience. Definitely a memorable one. This room will be white. Or should it be black? Up to you. I think it'll be white. Because you're lazy to colour, right? No. You sure? Sure. Look at me and say you're sure. Look at me. Sure. Look at the camera. Sure. Lazy, right? No. Yes? No. But I'm gonna throw the background here. You know why? Why? Because you're not lazy anymore? No. Yeah. Because this blue, the holes need some colour. So I need to colour the background in order for that. <laughs> this is my drawing of my very first day at the office and the person in front of me is Yuan, who is the sound guy in NOC. The thing next to me is not a bra, it's actually my sunglass which I eventually took away. It was only now that I realised that the tables and chairs behind me were not supposed to be there. It was actually this yellow screen with a high chair. Um, yeah, and Isabel took photos of us that day. I also have memories outside of knockout and outside of filming and that is with um, my bosses, Ryan and Sylvia. If you can see, I drew a dog on a log and a chick which is supposed to be a duck and a bowl of rice. Okay, so the main bulk of my memory in NOC so far is knockout. Ladies and gentlemen, Whoa, shit, shit. So guys, I managed to finish this within 15 to 20 minutes. It was between this, this one, was Sui, and the one that I actually got eliminated. Uh, I decided to go with this one because I feel that this is really something that I went all out for and I won in this episode. I am done. That's Ryan, Sylvia and my memory that I shared just now. This is Ryan. I had lunch with him once and, and it's my favourite memory of him so far. Yeah, he really taught me a lot during, over lunch. I learned a lot from him and we had food king good duck rice. Can you see this? Looks like a chick but am I? Uh? This is Sylvia. She doesn't know this but when we went to her place uh, for our meetup post knockout for her to get to know us better, she actually asked a few questions and then she reached the 
question of like when is your birthday so I replied 18 July 1994 and then she looked at her phone for a while and then she said good dog <laughs> I thought she called me a dog then after the meeting I kept thinking about it hey, how come she called me dog uh? like is it what did I do then I realised she was talking about my zodiac I am a wood dog Ta-da! Not bad right? Considering I've not coloured in years So this is me I'm crying I've cried a pool of tears And the rainbow symbolises That at the end of the day Everything is going to be okay And there's always a rainbow after the storm Yes So that's my artwork And I am done! So I chose this shoot and this picture because this should actually um, was the dawn of the spin mom and this is I think one of the or even the first character that was given to me that was strong enough to carry on for other episodes and other videos so I really enjoyed this I really treasure my character and uh, this shoot was kind of like a turning point for me and my acting uh, role in NOC so now I'm done with my drawing. So this is my masterpiece, if I may say so. Um, Sylvia is actually right here, like talking about um, how much of an inspiration Nicholas has been to every one of us. I'm just like not processing anything anymore. At this point, I was dundered. Like my brain was just like. Psh! Aiman is trying to hold his tears and Nicholas just doesn't even give a shit because he is Tony Stark and he's awesome. Okay, so I am done with my drawing. This is my final drawing. I even coloured. So this was when Awa, Shaman and I stayed very late in the office about 2, 1 or 12 a.m. and we decided to cook Migoring because we were so hungry and our brains were fried so we just had to take some time off so that we can process more ideas so yeah this is our kitchen i hope you guys recognize it if not i suck Don't forget to comment down below who you thought did the best for this challenge. Let me know what you think about my drawing. Uh, which story do you, did you like the most? And don't forget to click the bell and subscribe.